What's going on fish nerds? Kind of a bad situation going on right now. So, I was in the kitchen on the computer when I heard a crash from out here in the garage. So, naturally I come out here to see what in the world is going on. And... Could be worse. Could definitely be better. Could be a lot better. Here's the situation. Yep. Looks like some water got onto this bookcase, weakened the wood, and she all went tumbling down. Luckily, it doesn't look like it busted the aquarium, thank the Lord. I mean, I don't see any or feel any leaks or anything. Water level's still where it was. Just diagonal now. So, yeah. Need to get this taken care of. Fun day, fun day. Okay. So, I got it moved. I got it picked up. And, uh, at first I was gonna just you know get a bucket or something and empty most of the water out but instead I figured maybe I could just lift it so that's what I did I just picked it up from where it was over here obviously I took the, the lights and stuff off it was pretty awkward you know getting a, a good stance over here to pick it up but got it up sorry for the bad lighting the uh, light for the garage door opener is out so my lighting in the garage is subpar right now but still got it moved and uh, we'll see I'm gonna check it out some more make sure that we're not leaking anywhere it didn't crack so that's good so I think we're good but just gonna make sure I mean like I said water levels holding steady so I, I think we skated by with this one. And obviously it's all super cloudy in there now from one, the fall, and then me carrying it over here. Aquasol, or not the Aquasol, uh, the Fluval Stratum is all stirred up and water's all cloudy right now. But that's not a big deal. As long as the tank and the shrimp survived, Cloudy water for a minute is not a big deal. Whew, I'm out of breath. 15 gallons of water. It's heavier than you think if you pick it all up at once. Goodness. So what looks like happened is trickle tower, my filter pad got all clogged up. So this got all full and started spilling out over here I mean, because you can see it's running so all that's just coming out here and it starts splashing out onto all of this got this all wet you can see it's all over the block down there too and uh, wood I mean this is just particle board so it just soaked that right up and uh, this just collapsed Dundee gone dead so Thank the Lord the tank didn't bust, man. That'd have been a disaster. I mean, it's still not good, but definitely better than it could have been. Goodness. All right, well, I guess this is a new temporary home for this tank, so may as well get everything run to it while it's over here. All right, everything's hooked up and running. Let it sit for a minute, and it looks like the water's cleared up pretty well, for the most part, anyway. And uh, triple checked all the seals and everything and no leaking so looks like we skated by with this one guys my goodness talk about a heart attack but yeah even uh, did a head count on the shrimp and everybody's there everybody's doing fine other than uh, you know some churned up substrate and an overturned sponge filter 
Looks like we are none the worse for wear. Shrimp themselves, still a little cloudy trying to focus in on them back there. Everybody's doing good. No babies to report as of yet, but everybody seems to be doing well. Hopefully we'll have some shrimplets soon. At least see somebody buried up, but yeah, definitely thankful right now that this tank is still alive. Whoa, way out of focus. There we go. Yeah, this could have been way, way worse. Very glad that this did not turn out the way it could have with a busted tank and water all over the floor, maybe some dead shrimp. Oof. Would not be happy with that. So, very glad that everything turned out all right. And a lesson learned, when I replace this, probably gonna be something metal all right guys so that's what I've got for you today I wish it could have been something better you know showing you off a new fish or something like that but you know sometimes things just go wrong and you just got to deal with it so that's what I'm doing today thank you all for watching you guys are awesome God bless your fish nerds I'll see you next time